My mum made all of my clothes and uh, she used to knit and sew and she'd collect buttons and ribbons, you know, pieces of fabric, things most people would throw away. I studied fine art and sculpture at Edinburgh, but I grew up in Carlisle, which is the home of Linton Tweed. It's a traditional mill, and I actually worked there as a student in their design room, and uh, I was piecing together their fabrics for all the trade shows, but they, they had these, these bin bags filled with these little pieces of tweed remnants, and I said, well, you know, what are you going to do with these things? And they were like, oh, you can have them if you want. I colour-coded them, put them into boxes, put them in the cupboard, and thought, you can just stay there. One day I'll know what to do with you. I rescued them from the bin, essentially. When I finished my fine art degree, I started working as a researcher in a film company. And I loved it, but um, I'm not very good at sitting still without keeping my hands busy. And I think there was no tangible item at the end of it. I didn't feel like it was a very productive thing for me to do. And I thought, I, when I was sitting there at work, I thought, well, all these things I could be making right now. It wasn't until I went backpacking around Southeast Asia, it just dawned on me when I saw people using their hands at the markets. And they had their little piece of pavement and they had their, their ability to use their hands and they made these amazing little things. And when I was in, in, uh, in Hanoi in Vietnam, I found this on the side of a pavement. It was a covered button maker. And it, it inspired me to start you know, using the scraps of tweed to make these buttons, because you only need a really small piece. And I thought, well, thank, thank goodness, I, I found something to do with my little scraps of material. I make buttons, and um, perhaps I can turn them into jewellery, um, cushions, or, or clothing. There's just so much potential. Hello, Katie. How are you? Oh, fine. Thank you. The each remnant of tweed is so beautiful. I mean, they're too precious to throw away. The, the yarns that they use, the colours, the weaves, the patterns, they're like little exquisite pieces of art in themselves, like precious jewels. I love this tweed. I'm, I'm incredibly proud that it comes from Carlisle. I've named Doris Moore after the house I grew up in. My grandfather studied jewellery. My other grandfather was in textiles. My mum taught me how to sew. And I suppose it all, it all came together, and it, it's part of who I am.